Good morning guys, how are you guys doing? It's a beautiful, windy, cold Thursday morning. Winter is already coming guys. So I'm going to this cheap mall or store. This is my first time going actually but they usually sell like clothes in like cheap clothes or clothes at a discounted price you know so for me because winter is coming i just want to get like cardigan and also like winter jacket i don't know if i'll be able to see winter jacket so if i'm able to see winter jacket i will just get winter jacket but basically i just want to get like a shop for winter clothes like cardigans right cute cardigans at affordable price and also like winter jacket so basically those are the things i really want to get and i'm going to bring you guys along with me and show you guys how the market looks like i'm actually very i'm getting late guys and i need to catch up with the tram so let's just go um i'm passing like short calls because i'm late so basically it's just to get cardigans and also like winter jackets i pray it's affordable but the market is actually affordable right so those are the two things that i'm actually getting nothing more because winter is coming as you guys can see i'm already putting on like this um okay let me show you guys like my outfit this way so i have this top but because it's winter i have this coat and then jean and then sneakers and this is what my outfit looks like and i have my shopping bag here because when you're shopping here one cultural shock and i feel like it applies to everywhere abroad generally is that when you buy stuffs they're not gonna give you bag you have to go with your shopping bag or like okay i need to get down god <laughs> so one cultural shock is that you have to come with your shopping bag because they're not gonna give you bags or nylon or anything and in africa maybe in nigeria for an example when we buy things they'll give you nylon or like bags and then you'll still be like oh, double it give me two you know but here you have to come with your bag if you don't come with your bag forget it so i have my shopping bag with me trench coat a top jean and sneaker so i'll bring you guys along we are going to explore the market i have what i want to buy and target so i'm not exceeding that basically just like winter stuff it's getting cold and it's time to start shopping for winter stuff because ah, the winter season is actually very very long long <laughs> Maybe just cardigans basically because like a Charlie thick cardigan so that I can change the set of cardigans that I have that I've used for a year so that I can change them and also like winter jackets. Um do I need to get winter boots? Maybe if, if I'm to buy winter if I'm to buy winter boots, maybe I think I'm just gonna buy one like one just to add to the one that i have because for me i kind of like prefer sneakers to winter boots i don't know guys i'm actually late and i need to catch off my train because this is where the train guys this is can you see this is where the train is gonna pass so i'm gonna see guys later <laughs>
lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay. I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays. Way back a year ago. I've changed for the better this time. I thought I would never be fine. I strive just to say I'm alright. And for the first time in a long time, I'm alright. I've seen a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay. I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays. Way back a year ago. a year ago I'm done shopping I'm gonna show you guys what I bought but basically like I dropped some stuff things that weren't fitting well or things that were big or somehow somehow and then I took some stuffs I think in total I bought about 11 pieces and even though I sent the money that I didn't want to buy anything apart from winter stuffs I still ended up buying um, I think about three tops like normal round neck top and then two jeans so the price of each of them like anything you pick in the store anything you pick at all is too zotty right and that too is not even up to one dollar so it's about 50 cents somewhere around 50 cents for anything you pick at all so even if you pick like a crop top it's still the same to um zotty 50 cents even if you pick like a winter jacket or something very big it's the same price basically so um, I think so far it's actually very good and you guys people are shopping people are shopping people are packaging themselves okay and the dresses are actually very neat some are neat some are summer summer and my advice is that when you're going to this kind of store you have to go with a second eye like what I mean by a second eye basically is that you have to go with what I mean by a second eye I mean by second eye is that you have to go with someone because you have to ask someone like maybe like your friend or something of course it has to be your friend because if you're asking strangers you might not really get 
your like their opinion and i'm sure you don't want to disturb strangers who also came to shop right so when you go with your friend you have to keep on asking is it nice does it look good on me is it cute is it this and then you have to you know drop so it was actually okay um nice shopping experience I got most of the winter stuff but I didn't really buy enough cardigans right because the cardigans had like the same design like wool net kind of cardigan and I just took one of it because to me it feels like everything was the same thing you know just color difference so go with someone something also um, struck my attention there of course people shopped and everything was empty literally right but Something also struck my attention there is the fact that I saw a lady or a woman who was buying to resell, right? Which is actually amazing. Like that's like another business. Um, what am I going to say now? Business strategy. She was buying. She was taking the pictures. So they have like nice background where you can dress, and they also have like mannequin also. So she was actually taking like. Um, what am I gonna say now? She was taking cute pictures of the dress to basically get them like resold, right? That's like what she usually does. So, and definitely, it's a good business because she's definitely gonna have profit, like no matter what, because it's actually very cheap. So by the time she irons it, wash it, maybe do some laundry on it and then put it up for a little price above this price i'm sure it's going to be profit because no matter how little you sell it even if she sells it for as low as two dollars come on you bought it for 50 cents and then you're selling for like two dollars that's also profit right and also people usually come early so the store opens by 10 a.m we got there around i think past 10 and most of the things were already empty because people come early to pick the best or the neat one so next thing now is i'm heading to african market um, i need to get some stuff since i'm outside and it's a bit close to each other so one thing about this store, i don't know if i if i mentioned it one they open only four stores days of the month so you can only buy it at this Tuzwati first Thursday of the month every other day the price is normal so um, they open by 10 the morning. so I think those are the two things so now I need to go to the African market to buy I kind of like know what I want to buy I just need to buy like palm oil that's all except if I see another thing that I'm interested in then I'll show you guys what the African market looks like I know you told your friend you're not okay And tell me what's wrong and why you never said you felt that way And guess you're trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away, yeah, 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 yeah. As you fade away Yeah, I'm about to fade away Cause every time I wake up I feel like it's Monday Something's going wrong with all the chemicals up in my brain All of a sudden I don't look at anything the same way Got a build up of my thoughts sitting in an ashtray I'm sorry that I'm so inconvenient, okay Just let me be me and I'll stay out of your way I can see the way you look at me, I'm such a disgrace I never really asked to be brought into this place You wanna love me? Well then baby, have a taste All the highs and the lows no, you'll never be the same I don't really wanna hurt you But I can't control the pain If you're sticking by my side Maybe we could be okay Okay, okay Maybe you could be the change I need today I promise that I've never fell this way I really hope that you Will choose to stay Through all the pain I know you told your friend You're not okay And tell me what's wrong And why you never said You felt that way Trying to stay strong and fake a smile until I look away But I've known you too long, it hurts to watch your blue eyes fade to grey As you fade away
was just... yesterday we had of course lectures have started so we had class yesterday and the professor was talking about like food different foods like polish food and then african food so this it comes in different uh, form but it's still the same thing so yeah it's called kashamana it's just like a very powder so like let me just show you guys what it looks like it's just like a powdered form right so we nigerians or like africans generally we use it to make like um we use it to make um semo like we use it in a solid form to get like a solid structure right so we turn i'm going to show you guys how we usually do it and it ends up like semo or um what is this thing like solid form like swallowed form and that is how like majority of us like africans i don't know like i'm breaking out and it's actually very big but i just did not bear. i tried squeezing it that's why but it's okay so um we usually make it in a solid form right just so we can get like this solid form and that is how i thought like but that is what I thought it was the kashamana. So it's called kashamana in Polish. What the kashamana is actually used for or made of, you know. So yesterday in class, our professor was like, I don't know how the topic led to kashamana, but of course we're talking about like food. And she was trying to say that the kashamana, okay, we were saying that we've been able to substitute it like kashamana for a solid form. And she was just like, kashamana is a solid form. The way the kashamana is supposed to be used, or the way Polish people use it, is that they pour it in water. You can see like it's like a powdered foam. So they pour it in water, right? And then they add like um, berries on top, or they add spice on top to feed kids. <laughs> so basically, they use it like stemiak or like um, the way we use like golden or sterile for kids and that is what kashamana is for it's supposed to be poured inside like a cold water and then you put like spice and you feed your baby with it and we're just like something that we are using as solid form already you guys get so awesome. even when you feel low you can still go even when you feel slow you can still go even when there's no hope you can still go i never answered a no man i still go go Every single day I'll be making moves Till I'm buried in my grave uh, To the system I don't wanna be a slave I've been doing shit my way uh, Or the highway And in the driveway Is a nice range Cause I grind through the climb I invite pain You'll never hear me bitch Nah, I don't complain Just gotta flip the switch And you can go and obtain Anything you want Anything you need Your mind's got the key ingredient It's belief uh, They'll see with the negativity But I just slide right by that Low, you can still go Even when you feel slow You can still go Even when there's no hope You can still go I never answered a no Man, I still go Go, 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 go Some batter in your brain uh, That's why they say Fake it till you make it, eh And if you play that game Then you just might make a change Rearrange all the bad to okay Take the worst stuff saying Turn them to a game Take the best stuff saying Put them on display On repeat in your brain Till you're feeling no more pain uh, Never slow yourself down You can do some more Push past start the pain And you'll find a door Open it up And finally explore Everything that you thought You could never do before uh, And even when you feel low Still go. Even when there's no hope, you can still go. I never answer to no man, I still go.
go.